Welcome back to Digital Class and this discussion for reproduction in plants and animals booklet. And let's look at this question together. So here it says that the flow chart below shows the human reproductive system. And we are given that S from female, T from male, it will come together and it will go through a process X, then it will develop into a young. So based on the flow chart above, we need to name the reproductive cells that both the letter S and T represent. So S from female. So what is that thing that actually, uh, what is the female reproductive cells? We know it's actually the egg cell. Okay, egg cell. How about T? T is a male reproductive cells, which is, we call it as sperm. Okay, simple, and let's move on. B, what is the process X? Describe what happened during the process. So uh, it's actually very simple. We know that this is something we call it as fertilization. Fertilization. And what has happened during fertilization? So during fertilization, the sperm fuses, fuses with the egg cell. That's all, okay? But if you want to further describe, you can say that and and develop into a fetus. Into a fetus. Okay, this is O. Okay, and that's all for B. And now let's move on to the next part of the question. Now they're asking, where does the young develop in the human reproductive system? So after fuses, then where does it actually develop? So the young one actually develops in where? The young develop in the womb of the mother. Okay? So again, fuses that you implant to the wall of the womb and develop there. Okay, so develop in the womb of the mother. And that's all for this question. And again, it's a simple question, but again, it's something for you to take note and learn again and revise again before you move on to the further harder questions. Okay, thank you. See you. Bye-bye.